Dr. Mixter, we'll see you now. So are you going to take a seat, or do you wish to conduct this interview on your feet? Oh, um, yeah, I guess I'll take a seat. <laughs> so, uh, should we start the interview? Uh, I mean, I can come back if this is a busy time. Oh, my dear. This interview began the moment that you opened that door. Now, where did you go to university? Stanford. What did you study? Psychology, with a minor in human biology. As opposed to? Mm, sorry? Human biology, as opposed to? Uh, plant biology, I guess. Uh, I figured what better way to learn about what ourselves and what we're made of, right? Hmm, quite. Now, why would you desire this position over, say, a more clinical one? You're surely qualified based upon your resume. Well, I wanted to be close to the patients and experience the... Close to the patient, please. You can trip over a psychological study while walking down the street. There are plenty of psychopaths in the world, Miss Mullen. Are you one of them? Mm, no, sir. Do you mean to tell me that you want to change light bulbs? and waste baskets to be close to my patients? Why here? Well, your clinic has such a rich history. Um, I figure I can learn a lot from such an established place. I guess that is something we have to offer. Now, what do you know about a rich history? Well, in my research, I saw that you used to specialize in child vet, child vet but that word closed down and was replaced with an adult a couple years ago. Why do you suppose that is, Ms. Mullen? Mm, lack of funding? More sick adults than children? Hmm. You may quickly learn that there's no shortage of mentally unstable individuals. Hmm. Yes. And if you do begin employment here, you'll certainly learn that History is best left in the past. in the evening. I will meet you to show you around and to start you with your duties. I shouldn't have to say this, but I expect you to be prompt. Sorry, who is this? I would have thought that obvious, Miss Mueller. This is Dr. Mixter from Steiner Psychiatric Hospital. Oh, so that means I got the job? Indeed. You are available to start Monday night, yes? Yes, yes sir. 9 p.m. sharp. 9 o'clock. Oh wow. Thank you so much, sir. I Sir? Sir? And those are your basic duties. Once you've been on the job a bit longer, we'll be giving you more detailed tasks. This is the adult psychiatric ward. This is where you'll be doing basic maintenance, changing waste baskets, changing light bulbs. It's all pretty old. Mm. Did it used to be the children's ward? I will advise you, Ms. Mullen, to focus on the present and the tasks at hand. Don't get lost in this hospital's past. Yes, sir. Oh, Delaney, come meet our newest employee. Lisa, this is Delaney. Delaney, Lisa. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. This is Lisa's first night tonight. I'm sure you'll be taking good care of her. Yes, sir. After her first few rounds, we'll meet up and see how it went. Okay, sounds good. Mm -hmm. Very well then, we'll leave you to it.
Hey, hey, it's late, come on. Hey, what's your name? It's time to go to bed. Hey, what's your name? Hello? change in room 12. We're making good time. Cool. You, you know, it's funny. I didn't really think I'd get this job. The interview didn't exactly go well. Dr. Mitchell said that you were the only person he interviewed with. Really? He felt that you were the perfect for the job and he didn't need to interview anyone else. Cool. <laughs> nice tattoo. Yeah. I forget I have him sometimes. What does it mean? represents a lot of bad things I did when I was younger. Like what? I'm sorry, I, I didn't mean to pry. It's okay. They're in the past, so let's leave them there. Fair enough. How's your first day going? Not bad. Um, I ran into this little girl earlier. She was like 12 or 13. I told her to go back to bed. I guess they don't lock the kids up at night. Uh, are you sure it was a girl of that age? Yeah. She was carrying a teddy bear. Had to be 12 or 13 at the most. Um, okay. What? I don't think there are any children of that age here. What? In fact, I, th I think our oldest participant is 20 years old. You're kidding, right? No. I'm serious. And who is the little girl I saw in the hallway? I trust your night is going well? Sir, I saw something on my shift. Something I think you should know about. Oh? What was it? I saw a young girl with a teddy bear. We don't treat children here, Miss Mullen. I, I know, but I, I know what I saw. She was in the children's ward. Miss Mullen, this facility has done a lot of good for a lot of people, even if there are things about it that we'd like to forget. This hospital will continue to treat its patients and provide employment for not only you and myself, but also Delaney and the other nurses. We cannot change the past, Miss Mullen, no matter how much we'd like to. But, but sir. Do I have to remind you again, history is best left in the past. That'll be all. <laughs> 